The ninth edition of the Corporate Awards took place in Douala, Cameroon on December 1st, attracting a number of high-profile companies. This prestigious event gave the organizers the opportunity to extend to the public the aim of this African-wide human resource management program. A few years ago, I was doing a research in Cameroon, trying to find out how companies design their policies implement their policies, train the line managers, managers to understand how policy works. And it was a little bit difficult because I didn't have any ready document to help me get the information that I wanted. I contacted my friend and schoolmate Paul Akotako, who is also a board member, and he sent me what is called the code of conduct of Cameroon, you know, work of conduct. And he told me, if you want to understand how it works, you have to read all of this. It, is, it was this thick. And I told myself, it was in French. And I said, I'm not going to read this. This is not going to work. But how do I get these policies from these people who use it every day? And then the corporate awards was born. The aim of the Corporate Awards is to reward companies that have innovative human resource policies in place within their organization. It identifies best management practices through a combination of internal research and online voting by creating healthy competition that puts them on a level playing field with international companies. The aim is to celebrate these organizations and promote excellence. This year's team gave companies the opportunity to share their innovations in human resource management, under the team Highlight Your Business Achievements, it's all about people. Over the past eight years, the Corporate Award Boards has been successful in the expansion of this Pan-African initiative to a number of countries. The evening marked the success of nine years of the Corporate Awards and highlighted the evolution of the events in different African nations. Ghana was chosen to host this edition alongside Cameroon after Cameroon in 2016, Gabon in 2017, Ivory Coast in 2018, and Senegal in 2019. For their excellence in human resource management, a total of 79 companies were awarded. The increase in the number of categories awarded is a notable feature of this ninth edition of the Corporate Awards. Unlike previous years, when only seven categories had been taken into consideration, this year the awards include 10 categories. This year, there were 10 categories covering every area of the internal research on investment in people, the promotion of diversity and inclusion, and the recognition of employers of choice through internal research. Other categories included internal research on employee relations, internal research on innovation and adaptability, and many more. The winners of each category were celebrated in recognition of their outstanding achievements in their respective fields and had the opportunity for a show of appreciation. Uh, to win the QHSE award at the corporate event, and we are very proud of what we've done. 11 years service of supplying free gas to, the, to Douala, and we have more than 4 million man hours injury free. I feel very proud today. Mavians is a fintech organization, and we specialize in facilitating digital payments and financial transactions and these two categories are really close to our hearts employer of choice and innovation and adaptability the evening was also an opportunity to celebrate other business models that are making an active contribution to the building of the community the impact and importance of the corporate awards in the field of human resource management in africa continues to grow attracting more and more companies across the continent